once we purchase it.
Answer. Indeed. I am most eager to engage in some unadulterated violence. At your command, of course, Master. Statement. I will enter into your service now, Master. I am certain you will make adequate use of my primary functions. My gears are practically quivering with anticipation.
No one leaves Anchorhead without proper authorization. Well, let's see it. Come on. All right. I'll just scan that and you're off. I'll keep it on file, too. Good luck out there. You'll need it. Hello there. You're heading out into the desert? You're a hunter, right? You must be if you've been allowed to leave Anchorhead. When you see Tannis, and I know you old boys always stick together, tell him his wife hopes he enjoys the anniversary gift. You're just another of his buddies from that hunting club. I know you're kind. You all cover for each other, I bet. Well, he can do what he wants. He'll get what he deserves. I bought my own license just so I could see that he did. Oh, I'm through planning. I just left him a little mess that he has to take care of. If he's smart, he'll be just fine. But he's not smart. Just a little something to remember me by. Something that symbolizes our years together. Something that will blow up in his face. Of course, he'll never understand how appropriate it is. He can't talk his way out of this one. He's not smart enough. Oh, I'll be long gone soon enough. The next shuttle to... anywhere, really. I've had it with cleaning up his messes, repairing his droids. If he lives, he can try and get by on his own. I doubt he'll last long with no one to listen to his lies. I'm sure you do. Like I said, when you see him, tell him his wife Marlena says hello. Could you help? I seem to be, uh, doomed. Hold on there. How about talking to me before you go messing with those things? I need your help. Hey there, thanks for stopping. I appreciate it. I've been stuck without water for hours. Wasn't looking good. Oh hey, it's you. I remember you at Foz's place. Could I get you to help out a fellow hunter? Well, uh, it would appear that I worn out my welcome with my wife Marlena. She fixes my droids. <laughs> Fixed them good this time. Commentary. One would hope the female is better at repairs than Yukalaka. I still would like to crush his neck, master. I triggered some sort of trap she programmed. She probably figured I wouldn't be smart enough to get out. Here she was right. Something about me not following her archaic rules for proper conduct in a marriage. I swear I never saw this coming. Hey, I'm the victim here. I'm not sure how divorce works where you're from, but this is a little extreme, don't you think? The wife put a kink in my battle droids. They're in some sort of discharge loop. And if I move from this spot, they're threatening to blow up. She knew I wouldn't know how to fix them. If you try to do some repairs, they don't care if you move. It's just me who's stuck. Commentary. I say we blast the meat bag and save you the trouble, Master. What's with all the droids lately? My wife get to you too? Negative. I just don't like organic meat bags. Except for the Master, of course. Uh... I'd, uh, really appreciate a bit of help, please? Uh, what do you have in mind? Uh, 
Hey, wait for a moment. I need these rigs. I'm no marksman. No way I can agree to that. No way. Just access each droid's repair interface. You'll have to do some tinkering, but be careful. One explosion, I can survive. Any more than one, and I'm dead. Oh, and uh, ignore the message Marlena left in there. No way do I deserve this, I swear. Having fun on the dunes, Tannis? I made sure you would. Here's the deal. Your precious droids have trapped you. They'll hold you until you die of thirst. Make a mistake while repairing them, they explode. Have a good death. My mother was right about you. Having fun on the dunes, Tannis? I made sure you would. Here's the deal. Your precious droids have trapped you. They'll hold you until you die of thirst. Make a mistake while repairing them, they explode. Have a good death. My mother was right about you.
That was unpleasant. Thanks for your help. I'd have been a goner. Hey, and the old bat thought I was dead. <laughs> you wanted me to give up my trade? Well, consider it done. Maybe I can rent my droids for security or something. Thanks again. I doubt any of those uptight hunters would have helped, and I doubt the wife is coming back. I'm heading back to the shop. I hope she left the manuals for these things behind. I'm grateful to them.
on this will get a nasty shock. Whoever steps on this will get a nasty shock. Whoever steps on this will get a nasty shock. Whoever steps on this will get a na nasty shock.
Yes? Doesn't matter. Can you handle a blaster? It may attack again at any second. I doubt we could hold out on our own against another wave of them. You would be right. Came out of nowhere. Wait, damn it. Here they come again. How did they do that? Whoever steps on this will get a nasty shock.
Thanks for your help. I don't think we'll try holding this position for much longer. We're not soldiers. Did the company send you? It's about time they drove these animals out. I don't have time for this sort of thing. I'm through with the desert. You can take your sand people, great dragons, and crazy hunters. Just that they attack everything on sight. Well, I suppose they don't attack each other, but any outsider is as good as dead. The company tried to arm us and even set up remote self-powered turrets on the mining route, but, but that just made things worse. We're not soldiers. They still kill us and then take our weapons off our corpses. They even had the Jawas disable the turrets and set them around their enclave. It's like a fortress now. I don't know how you're going to break through all of that. Me, I'd sneak in. But what actually, I'll just get back to Anchorhead. They use whatever they scavenge. They seem to hate our technology, but they love to turn it against us. That goes for blasters and turrets, too, I guess. It's not like you need to be a genius to operate them. They probably don't even bother with special settings. They just watch for people approaching and switch them on. I don't have time for this sort of thing. I'm through with the desert. You can take your sand people, great dragons, and crazy hunters. Yeah, so do we. There's no way we're appearing this thing while getting attacked over and over. The desert can have it. Ah, the Jawas will salvage it eventually anyway. Then we can buy it back and start over. <laughs> Makes sense to me. Thanks for your help. I don't think... Did the cup... Well, you've got a lot of work ahead of you. Do you know about their enclave in the south? Don't even try to go near it. They've taken all the Zerka weapons that were supposed to protect our sand crawlers. That place is a fortress, a death trap. You'll have to find some way to sneak into the place. Glad it's not my job. Yeah, so do we. There's no way we're appearing this thing while getting attacked over and over. The desert can have it. Ah, the Jawas will salvage it eventually anyway. Then we can buy it back and start over. <laughs> Makes sense to me. What choice do we have? They have to be killed. All of them. Yeah? Yes?
Dạ Not have been his intention, but he did actually communicate something. Translation. Result. I believe I have succeeded in confusing him, Master. We have shown an interest not common among outsiders. Let's 
simulation. Translation. He is expressing disbelief. As am I. But his duty requires that he report to his chieftain. Extrapolation. It would seem that we are at least worthy of curiosity for the moment. I would much rather this get bloody, Master, but it is your call. Translation. I can translate with some guarantee of accuracy that he is demanding to know why he should let us survive this encounter, Master. Extrapolation. I understand that you are Force-sensitive, Master, but I lack sufficient knowledge to make an accurate assumption. Hypothesis. Perhaps your ability does not take the place of actual language study when the subject is out of the ordinary. Or perhaps the Sand People confuse your ability because they actively refuse to communicate with most outsiders. I have no data on this, sadly. Translation. <laughs> Translation. He claims he has no reason to believe you, Master. Your kind have tainted this land with machines and uncaring, ignorant feet. Translation. He requires proof of good faith. We must make a contribution to his people that shows we are not a threat. Shall I blast him now, Master? Translation. Translation. He refuses to waste breath on you until you are proven to be an ally of his people. He seems quite adamant about it. Please, let me blast him, Master. Translation. Translation. He plans to move his people farther from Anchorhead, but they need to build up stores of water first. He says you must aid him. Translation. He wants moisture evaporators from the Zerka. If you deliver them, he will order that his people reduce their attacks on miners. Translation. Translation. He says you will get no more answers until you have proven you are an ally of the Sand People. Translation. Translation. He says that will never happen, Master. Ignorant outsiders continually desecrate their most reverential customs. This will always demand a response. An attitude I can respect. Protocol. From his perspective, a reduction is already a large step. It is doubtful you will get agreement on much more than that. Translation. Translation. Hmm. He does not believe you, Master. You will only be allowed to re-enter the Enclave when we have the evaporators with us. Translation. We are to be escorted outside. He will wait, but he doesn't believe we are coming back.
Yeah? Master? What? for your help. I don't think did the company Well, they've taken you'll have to I don't have time for this Yes uh Kunaba Murira, Rati Kun, Mujasha Pampa. You never know what the Sith will do. Mujasha Pakat. Kino no Nama Paule, Rati. Again, is there something else? All right, then. Thank <laughs> you. 
Takom jedoba the one and Mochesh Taco Jedoba Mochashak Bak Takom Jedoba Mochashak Taco Mochashak Takom Jews Dach Jedoba the one and Jedoba. Why are you here, swoophead? Hunting doesn't give your kind the instant thrills you need, does it? Again? I've tr I don't go telling stories. Although you won't last long on this planet, you just aren't cut for it. If that's what you want, I'm not sure what you hope to get out of me, though. You'll have to ask around. The local job. Good hunting. Greetings again from the offices of Zerga Corporation. Is this about bounties or something else? I see that, but do you have the all-important chieftains, Gaffy? That was what you agreed to get for us. Then I'll take those off your hands, but the real prize is still out there. I assume that by out of the ordinary you're referring to the destruction of... I'm afraid... Very well. Of course. Zerka Corp for your needs here. Certainly. Please pose your questions. I suppose you're right. It's not like you can't tell the state of things just by looking around. Mining operations here have not been a success. With the sand. We can't ignore. There's prob. The Jawa. Farewell. Ki muli ra Chiwi aita ka chong chi cha Agi inko tune chuna muli ra Tangi wama jiko na Tong ki pa nongku nek abog Chiwa er aita ka ki cha na chupor nipo Kun muli ra slimo poi wanga Tangi wama ji human ak in ika tune Chiwi aita ka chong chi cha Agi inko tune chuna muli ra Tangi wama ji ko na Tong ki pa nongku nek abog ki muli ra kun kin Tong hi duwama ak ki inko tune Ba ba hasan shan No ba muli ra ti lai kung ka Ka kin cha na wa ba ka on Ba gwa shong konti ma chit um Ichu ta yun patisa Kimbani cha lora kun Baba Hassan Shan No ba muli ra ti lai kunka Ka kin cha na wa ba ka on Ba gwa shong konti ma chit um 